and miniature engines uh, coming to an end. The next item in the program, the best in this time, is the Walter Road British Legion marching band and called drum, driving the Queen Arena, followed by the uh, Fulbury Bird State demonstration, and then the Epic Fund, Epic Surf, the Season 5, and the Night Season Jazz, and the Epic Surf, and the Epic Surf, the Epic Surf, and 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 the Epic Surf, Arena. It's the time now at uh, a quarter past two. They're just coming up to the parade of the motorcycles, the veteran vintage motorcycles, which is probably at two from five this afternoon with an outbreak gun dogs. The tractors are in there at the countryside main events at three fifteen. And they have prize giving uh, for all the various shows that we run here over the weekend at four o'clock. That's over in the countryside main events uh, area and then they finish up the program to their grade of horses at the 415 this afternoon. The information point is at the top end of the ground. It's by the farm building where that very tall radio area is. And under this badge you'll find a yellow flag. Back you'll find the information point. And from there, you can purchase your program that's got valued at just one pound. And they'll give you details of exhibitors, the area demonstration time, and most importantly, a site map, because this is a very large site this weekend. There's an awful lot going on. And if you have a specific interest, you'll need to know where that particular item is. There are also various features, and this is of the stands, and it's a nice memento for your day here at the Instagram show. The information point is also the place which acts as the media. And apart from watching the arena activity, you could also visit the 35 working heavy horses, which are near the countryside ring, on the right-hand side. You can watch them at work and talk to the owners, and you'll get a chance to get up close to these magnificent animals. If you take a look at the three craft marquees that we have here this weekend, there's a huge range of handmade goods on display, which can be purchased, many of which you can wish are actually being made. There are 150 trade stands here this weekend, with an enormous range of products and services on display. Everything from country clothing and tools to delicious olives and children's toys and kites there in the mix, as well as garden plants, and you might be surprised at what you might find. And of course you'll help to have the opportunity to do some early Christmas shopping. The food hall can be found near the bar. The food hall has a wide variety of special food and drink in an area well worth visiting. The South End Model Boat Club can be found by the reservoir with large marquees for the boats on display plus demonstrations of radio control of the boats on the water. Fast electric model boat racing takes place on the lake here in the afternoon and there will be some of the boats on the water all day. In the month's weeks you'll find the Muddy Port Working New Plant Run which will be performing rescue operations in the lake during the afternoon. There will also be a steamboat on the lake. Also by the lake you'll find the Essex Beekeeping Society and there will be beekeeping demonstrations throughout the afternoon. And of course don't forget not only is the uh, food hall here this weekend and the Hive restaurant open throughout the day. We also have many concessions around here on the site. Uh, we have all sorts of food available, uh, paninis and uh, well, hot dogs, uh, the lot really, including of course uh, those delicious cornish pasties that you'll find over near the beer tent. Um, we used to be discussing years ago about the fact that one of them has the word pasty written as P-A-S-T-Y and the school teachers used to go coffee because they said well that's just spelled with an I-E. Now not in Cornwall it isn't, it's spelled with a Y. Uh, well nowadays because of the management change uh, you'll find that it's actually now been spelt with an IE because they can't use the, the Y bit anymore uh, which keeps the teachers happy but uh, of course upsets the parents it's just proves you can't help it with help uh, it please everybody however if you're feeling hungry those Cornish miners you know they were hanging out on this so they weren't telling us about those two dishes plastics don't try my nose and uh, you won't anything else for the rest of the day wonderful We have uh, a lost child on the ground here. Now, there's a record, actually, it's the first one this weekend. Uh, Craig Redbourne, if you can hear me, uh, is very nine years old, got blue jeans, um, and gold 
Robinson, top five leader, it says here. Uh, Dr. Chase Brown hair, it says here. But Craig Redborn, if you can hear me, if you go to the information board, you need to make your way towards the building at the top end of the ground where the very tall radio mast is, and there you'll find the yellow flag with the information point underneath it. It's out there where your mother is waiting for you. Um, if you're not sure where that is, talk to any of the people with yellow jackets on, and they will guide you to the information point. That's Craig Redborn, who is nine years old. If you could please make your way to the information point or ask somebody where it is and they uh that is that in was formed in nineteen sixty four during the preservation of both going to be made. Some two thousand engines are used both in the UK and overseas. The next is made up of